Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you're welcome. Guys, I'm doing one hand. <laughs> I haven't done a one hand in a while. But I'm doing it because I'm eating an ice cream cone and I, I don't want to put it down. Holy Spirit for the collective. What is going on, Spirit? Whatever comes out, guys, is supposed to come out, right? Holy Spirit, what is going on? Let's see. Somebody's not happy. With how things worked out. Mm -hmm. It's like they want to come and talk to you. They want to talk to somebody about it, but they're not speaking up for themselves. Yeah, somebody's not happy with a queen, but they're not speaking up about it. They're not standing in their strength when it comes to whatever they need to say to this person. It looks like they're not happy with this person, right? Things could be over with this Ten of Swords. Yeah, this person's moving on. Somebody's walking away from this queen. There's going to be a tower. If the tower hasn't happened yet, it's going to happen. Maybe eventually the person that, that's not happy with the past will eventually stand up for themselves, right? And that will create the tower if you eventually stand up for yourself, right? So somebody's going to eventually stand up for themselves and end things so they can move on. It looks like they actually want to go and offer their love to someone else. They definitely have a target in mind. Uh, they're going to offer a proposal of love to someone else. Like immediately after this ending. It could be somebody that they work with, right? Or somebody that they feel they work well with together. This person could be a divorcee. Or they could be in some type of hierophant or that maybe they have to leave some type of connection in order to come work with you. But this person is very reliable. They're coming in as the King of Pentacles with a proposal of some kind. Yeah, this person loves you. This is the Ten of Cups. This is the Ten of Cups. This person loves you. And right now they feel left out in the cold. They're tired of they're tired of feeling left out in the cold. They don't like that feeling. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> yeah. They're tired of feeling left out in the cold. Holy spirit. Hmm. It looks like they're going to have to deliver some bad news to somebody. Yeah, they're going to have to deliver some bad news. The bad news is they want that empress there. That's their ten of cups. That's who they want to go and work with. This is who they want to be with. This person's coming back. Look at them. Eight of cups. In reverse. Whoever walked away from you, I just saw 411. This person wants to come back. Guys, let's put some love on here. Right? Somebody is walking away from their past. They're not happy there, right? It took them a while because they wasn't speaking up for themselves, but eventually they did, and now they seem free. What's going on here, Spirit, right? Reconciliation, yep. Reconciliation. Somebody's coming back. Someone from your past is returning to your life after they had an ending. And then call it in your soulmate. 
Your prayers, your affirmations, and visualizations help to bring the two together. So if you think this is your soulmate, then you better start praying. You better start visualizing. You better start making it happen. I don't know. Go rub a, a rose quartz or something. I don't know. Whatever you do. And you two need to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation when this person do come back. They're going to tell you about their truth. And you need to tell your truth. Whatever it is, guys. Speak your truth. All right. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.